Tonight, former Governor Robert Bentley is saying that he may consider running for U.S. Senate in 2020. He said he never closes any doors in life on a local radio show this week. And just days ago, we sat down with a former governor for a look back at his time in office and what he believes should be his legacy. Well, first, I'm doing fine. Governor Robert Bentley's life looks a lot different now than it did two years ago, embroiled in political scandal that led to his resignation. There have been times that I have let you and our people down. The relics of an unlikely rise to the state's highest office now hang inside his Tuscaloosa dermatology practice. But he's been staying busy. He saw over 50 patients on the day we sat down to talk. Life throws some curveballs at everyone. You have to work through those things. And uh, you can't get bitter. Uh, you just got to stay on, on the track of, of what you feel like your purpose is in life. Uh, and, and, and I believe that my purpose in life first is to serve God and to serve people. His medical practice is his primary focus now. It's set to move to a larger office this summer. But Bentley still has political opinions and reflects on his efforts to balance the state budget and increase Medicaid funding. He pledged not to take a salary as governor until Alabama reached full employment. The state did just that a month after he left office. Am I, am I sorry for things that happened in certain ways? I am, but uh, there's no one out there that cannot say that. I'm not saying that you can't trust very many people in Montgomery, but you have to realize that uh, many of them are your friends because they want something. What do you want people to remember you for and what do you hope your legacy will be? I want people to realize that I did not go into this for any reason other than to serve those people in the state of Alabama that need to be served, all the citizens. So wherever God can put me and give me an opportunity to serve people, that's what I'm going to do. As for the Senate race, Governor Bentley has only said publicly that he isn't closing any doors. We'll have to wait and see. There is much more of our conversation on our website right now. Just search Bentley at CBS42.com.